When your Xfinity door or window sensor isn't working properly, there are several troubleshooting steps you can take to resolve the issue. First, check the sensor placement. The magnet must be positioned close enough to the sensor when the door or window is closed. The gap between them should be no more than half an inch for proper detection. Next, inspect the battery. Xfinity sensors use lithium ion coin batteries or CR2 batteries. A low battery is one of the most common causes of sensor failure, so replace it if the battery indicator shows it's running low. If the battery is new, but the sensor still isn't working, try power cycling it. Remove the battery completely, wait for one full minute, then reinsert it firmly. This resets the sensor's internal electronics. Finally, ensure the sensor is within range of your Xfinity home controller. Interference from Wi-Fi routers, microwaves, or other wireless devices can disrupt the signal. If the sensor is too far away, consider moving it closer to the controller. If you've tried all these troubleshooting steps and your sensor still isn't working properly, the next section will guide you through reconnecting your sensor to the Xfinity home system. If troubleshooting doesn't resolve your sensor issues, you'll need to reconnect it to your Xfinity home system. This process involves using the Xfinity Home app to reestablish the connection. Start by opening the Xfinity Home app on your smartphone or tablet. Make sure you're connected to your home Wi-Fi network for the best results. Navigate to the Devices section in your app. This is where you'll find all your connected sensors and security equipment. Look for your door or window sensor in the device list. Disconnected sensors will typically show a red status indicator or be marked as unavailable. Select the disconnected sensor and choose the reconnect or add device option. The app will guide you through the pairing process. Follow the on-screen instructions, which typically involve pressing a button on the physical sensor to initiate pairing mode. Make sure your touchscreen controller is also in pairing mode. If the app doesn't recognize the sensor, you may need to remove it from your system completely and add it again as a new device. This process essentially starts fresh with the sensor connection. If problems persist, consider using Xfinity's professional installation service, which is typically required for sensors. For self-monitoring customers, contact Xfinity support directly for assistance. Remember to check your Wi-Fi and network settings if you've made recent changes, as these can affect sensor connectivity. Also ensure there are no conflicts with other smart home devices during the reconnection process.